Welcome to Jupiter Academy channel. Let us see in today's class one problem given in 2019 NEET in the chapter Motion in Straight Line. So let us read the problem. A person traveling in a straight line moves with a constant velocity V1 for certain distance x and with a constant velocity V2 for next equal distance. Equal distance it refers to x itself. Then the average velocity v is given by the relation and these are the options given. So let us see how to solve this problem. So you know that in general the velocity is given by the formula displacement by time. Velocity equal to displacement by time. So now if, uh, if we consider the velocity as v, v equal to x by t. Let me just consider the displacement as x. So, v equal to x by t is the formula for us. So, now they said certain distance x. So, let us, let me just mark ab. ab is one particular distance. Let me call this as x. And let me consider another point c. b to c also the distance is x only they have given. Certain distance, let me take the first certain distance as ab. The next is certain distance as BC. And both they have given the letter X. So, equal distance in the second half also. But the velocities are different. You can see the first part of the distance, the person traveling with the velocity V1. And the next part of the distance is just traveling with the velocity V2. So, the velocity is V1 here and the velocity is V2 here. So, since the distance is same, the velocities are different, then naturally the time taken also will be different. So, T1, T2. So, now in the, this is the general formula. So, now let us write what is V1. V1 equal to x by T1 and V2 equal to x by T2. So, we, uh, we know that we have to find average velocity. So, what is average velocity? Average velocity is given by the formula total displacement by total time taken. So, what is the total displacement is nothing but x plus x which is equal to 2x. And what is the total time taken t1 plus t2. So, from this we can get what is t1. This implies that t1 equal to x by v1. And this implies that t2 is equal to x by v2. So that we can write T1 plus T2. So we can, uh, we already got what is T1, what is T2. So you can substitute in this formula. So that it will be 2x divided by x by V1 plus x by T2. Now x is, uh, x is common here. So we can take common out. So 2x into x when you take common out here, it will become 1 by V1 plus 1 by V2. Now xx gets cancelled. So, this side what do we get is V, average velocity V. So, average velocity V is equal to 2 divided by 1 by V1 plus 1 by V2. This option is not there. We can see uh, nowhere this option is there. So, we can just rearrange this uh, formula. So, that uh, let me take 1 by V1 plus 1 by V2 that side and V I can bring this side. So, that 1 by V1 plus 1 by V2 is equal to 2 by V. This option is very much available there on the board, which is nothing but option B. Thank you for watching Jupiter Academy channel. If you like it, you subscribe.